Hey, this is for real fans, real talk. Um, Mason Cameron, yeah, I've seen the uh, video. Now, there were like three different other occasions, along, two different other occasions, I think. Uh, I may have had three or four conversations with Mason out there. But there were two other occasions prior to the hotel that I thought Mace's life might be uh, at risk. One, he was driving around in a white drop top Mercedes Benz. And uh, he was with Stevie J and some other kid that supposed to have been strong out there in Cali. And I had to pull Mace to the side and tell Mace, yo, you from Harlem and you are like a meal ticket to some of these cats out here. You know, these cats will get at you and go back to their hood and brag about how they tore your head down to the white meat. Mace would say, I know, I know, Gene, I know. Another time I get a phone call and he's in the Century Club and some dudes got him trapped off. And when I get there, Mace is coming down the steps. And he's like, oh, Gene, you know, so I'm good, I'm good. And I say, yo, Mace, if you was good, I wouldn't be here. And the night Big got killed, uh, that morning, uh, I guess some people was, Puff had left, uh, he had went to San Diego, no, Puff went to, yeah, San Diego. You know, we was taking him to San Diego. He stopped our, our convoy because I was with Black Hands. At this time, Black Hands had came to the hospital. Uh, that's Chaz Williams and his crew. They're part, California, they're part of the Gorilla, the Gorilla Black Mafia. I think the Black Gorilla Mafia, the Black Gorilla Mafia, and Black Hands, they all the same thing. They strong out there. Black Hands is strong all over the, all over the United States because of the federal prison system. You know what I'm saying? Um, so Chaz had a few of those guys and everything like that. So me and Mace was talking on the phone and he was telling me how Brandy was trying to get him to go to the party and everything like that. Mm. So I spoke to him later after Big Head got killed. And Mace called and said, yo, it's about, you know, it's crazy bloods over here, Gene. And, you know, me and a couple of dudes went over there and we got him up out of there. That was it. I didn't see, you know, you know, I didn't see 70 bloods, but, you know, Mace could have seen that. But by the time we got there, you know, it wasn't, you know, you know how they do it out there in California. You could tell who blood, who crip, and all like that. But it wasn't, you know, I didn't see that many. But that's, you know, you can't say he didn't see that many. All right? That's for real fans and real talk. All right. Cut. What's good? It's your boy Daylight. You're now tuned in with realfansrealtalk.com. Bye, y'all. Real fans, real talk, we as real as you thought Real 